Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm doing a long-awaited spring clothing haul. Um, this is mostly going to be for Riker. I do have a spring clothing haul coming up for myself. I'm just like letting some things um, like slowly trickle in for my spring I'm gonna call it a, just like a spring haul because um, I did get like some perfume and things like that as well so um, let's hop on into the kids's spring clothing haul all right guys I've got crazy noise in the background per usual I always do there's never a good time to record in my house Mike is always doing something in the garage and like sawing I literally would have to like make a soundproof room in my house so I apologize ahead of time for all of the background like saw noises but stay tuned over on our m, &M Rustics channel and our m, m Rustics blog and Instagram everything is linked down below for you guys so you can see exactly what we're up to today in that garage I'm very excited for this one so um, the first thing that I'm, I'm gonna start with is something that um, that Kaya got and that is her new rain boots. They are dirty, she has worn these, but um, I absolutely love these. The Easter Bunny brought these this year. Um, I will have these linked down below for you guys. Um, these are super, super cute. They're Cat and Jack. Um, and again, the Easter Bunny brought these and Kaya's been wearing them every single day and I just think that they're just like, I'm not like super into like bright colors, but these are like kind of shiny um, and they're just kind of like a muted rainbow. Um, they're really cute. So Kaya loves those. Riker got new shoes as well and oh, these are my favorite. These are so cute. Okay, so these are the shoes that I got for Riker. I think that they are so cute. He is in, um, I got a size six for him. He's um, more so like in a size five. These are big for him, um, but he will grow into them and he's been wearing them rather comfortably with like thick socks. So um, these are also Cat and Jack. I got these from Target. Um, I'll have these, everything will be linked down below for you in the order that I mentioned them. Um, so go ahead and check out the description yeah. box. So go ahead and check out the description box um, and you can find the links for everything. But these are so cute. And I know that Target's been running a lot of deals on kids clothes lately, so check it out. So this haul is just Target, H&M, and Little Sleepies. Um, so I'm just gonna continue with the rest of the Target stuff and then we'll get into the H&M and Little Sleepies. All right, the next thing that I got for Riker um, was the um, Cat and Jack the Joggers with the reinforced knees. Um, these are a go-to of mine. They're a, these are a repurchase. I have them in this color for him um, in a smaller size, but I ordered in an 18 month. Um, I think that these just are so cute. I love the detailing on them. Like this, it's almost like moto. I don't know, I love them. And then like the jogger. Um, I got these in an 18 month, like I said, they're $9. And I got them, I wanna say I got all of this for 20% off when they were running their um, kids clothing sale. So really good deal. Um, and then I got the same ones in that army green. Um, I know a lot of people have these ones. They're so cute and they're really good quality and like so cheap. Just, it's such a good deal. Um, and then the last thing that I got for Riker from Target, I think this is the last thing. Yeah. The last thing I got for Riker from Target were the, um, just another pair of joggers for him. Um, these are like sweat joggers, kind of have that like Harlem shape to them. They're really cute and they're really comfy. These ones are a little bit thinner um, than like most of his other sweatpants. So I feel like they're comfier because it's easier for him to move in them. Um, anyway, anyways, I want to say these were like 750 and were 20% off. Um, during that sale. There's one more thing from Target that I forgot to mention. Um, I was looking for a spring jacket for Riker and I just wasn't loving any of the jackets that, like the actual jackets that they had. Um, I don't know, just like the colors and the styles. I'm really picky when it comes to the uh, the kids' clothes, especially Riker's clothes. Like Kaya gets a lot of hand-me-downs from um, Bryn, my sister Bryn, who's eight. Um, my mom buys like a lot of like Nike and Under Armour and like fun things like that. So Kaya gets a lot of that, um, which is why she actually didn't need a clothing haul for this spring and summer is because my mom had so many cute clothes for her as hand-me-downs and which is why there's not a ton here for her in the spring haul, but um, this jacket that I got for Riker, 
it's not a jacket it is a um so this jacket um that i get for raker is actually a hooded it's just like a hoodie a hoodie is a zip up hoodie sweatshirt and i got it in a 2t in my favorite brand from target art class that art class is my favorite for like unique clothing styles um i think Cat and Jack is really good for staples, but if you're looking for really unique styles, I think that our class has um, some awesome pieces of clothing for kids. I got this, it's like a faded, I love this little sweatshirt. It's like a faded, um, like almost denim looking sweatshirt. I love the details of like the fading on the bottom. Um, and it's got like paint splatters on it. And it's just, it's really cute and it goes with everything. And so he's always wearing like this little hoodie sweatshirt and these little shoes and it's so dang cute. Um, I'll see if there's like lucky charms all over this too because he wears this every day. This is his jacket. So um, right now in Minnesota, it's springtime. Usually in the mornings is when it's the coldest, um, but he's in his car seat and he has a blanket and plus you're not supposed to have them wear really thick jackets anyways with their car seats. So um, I always have car blankets for them and then they go straight into daycare by the time they're going outside and playing. It's nice and warm outside and just in case he does still have like his Columbia like snowsuit um, so that if it is a little bit chilly he can still wear that outside at daycare um, when it's like chilly whatever okay so that is everything that I got from Target um, this is by far my favorite this and then the um, the shoes those are my two absolute favorites that I got from Target now this H&M haul I always my H&M haul for him in the fall was super popular you guys really liked that so um, I figured it would be um, only appropriate to share with you the things that I got from H&M this spring um, some of them are rebuys I will say that and that is because I loved um, I loved some of the items that I purchased last fall for him so much that I had to just get him the same thing in the next size up. So we're gonna start with the sweatpants. Um, these jogger sweatpants are my absolute favorite from H&M. I wanna say this two pack was $17.99. Um, or maybe it's like, no, it's $29.99 and I had a 20% off coupon. So I got them for like $23.99 or something like that. Um, so, but they're a two pack and this is the one pair. They're just, these are my absolute favorites. And I love the faded style. And it has a little back pocket. And that sweatshirt from Target that I got, those, it goes so nicely with it. Um, and then I have the other one in that two pack is just a black pair. Um, and this pair also has that moto like design on it it's the exact same pair of sweatpants just in black and it's got that pocket um so i got him those in a like the sizing is a little bit different at h&m so i got instead of an 18 month i got him like one and a half to two year um the jacket that i got him is a 2t um so that it's a little bit baggier and he can use it for a little bit longer i don't like to buy him um clothes that are exactly his size i get him so they're a little bit baggy but um like not too much, you know, like not too big for him. That's something that he can wear for longer. Um, I don't know how to explain it, but I always get him just like a little bit bigger sizing. Um, and then I can like always like roll the cuffs up on his pants if they're too big. Um, so anyways, got those joggers again. Now those are the only ones that I did repurchase. Um, now I'm going to go into the I got one more pair of pants. Yeah, okay, I think this is the only other pair of pants I got from H&M. These are so cute. They're like a linen-y material. Um, and I got these in a, this is a 12 to 18 month. See what I mean? Like their sizing is really confusing. There's like one and a half to two years. There's 12 to 18 months. There's, yeah. So um, I got them at 12 to 18 month in these. And these can be like rolled up. So they're like, um, almost like capris I guess I don't know um, but they're just they're such a light material on um, like I said linen it feels like a linen blend to me but um, it has a drawstring on top as well super cute okay so I'm gonna go through the t-shirts that I got for Riker I got him so much I want to say I spent like gosh I don't feel like it was very much I want to say it was like $80 only from H&M and I just got so many things so I got him a three pack of shirts of these like Henley shirts and um, they've got like those like buttons on them so 
This is the first one in the pack that I got. Um, two buttons, like super, it's like the, that heathered look to it too. I don't know if you guys can pick up on that. But um, I just think that these are so handsome, especially with like little linen pants and he's got those little shoes. He does have, um, we purchased him more like summer things when we went to Disney back in, mm, back in February, end of January, February. And so he's got like these camo flip flops. He's got some water shoes. He has a new swimsuit from the, for this summer, all from Target. He's got some shorts um, from Target. He's got um, he's got like some short sleeve shirts that I got from Target. I will leave that video linked down below for you guys if you want to see more of like the summer clothing items that I have for him because I won't need to restock for him until likely later this fall or even like next winter. So um, he's pretty stocked for a while. I might pick up a couple of like cute pieces but I won't have to do a haul for him for quite a while. Um, getting into the rest of the Henley shirts, I've got a yellow one. Again, it's got that like heathered look to it. Um, and then it has a couple of buttons here in the front and the same thing, but in like a, like a tealish bluish color, like a pewter, um, blue and heathered again, super cute. I got those ones in a one and a half to two year size. I got him a best brother shirt. Um, I love this shirt. I don't know. I love like um, like graphic tees. Clearly, I'm wearing one for myself right now. But um, I love graphic tees. The only thing I didn't love is that there were like buttons on top. But I suppose that would come in handy like if he was dirty. Um, I'm just like now that he's like 14 months, I'm kind of over the like buttons and onesie stage. Um, I don't really enjoy onesies. I don't like the buttons. So, but I will deal because this shirt is just so cute. I want to say it was only like a few bucks. Great deal. The next shirt that I got for him from H&M is this tiger shirt. Now, actually I pulled this out of the laundry because he wore this, I think yesterday. Um, this I got in a one and a half to two year. It does, it fits him now. Um, it's a little big, but it fits him now. Um, I just, you guys know I love this color. It's got like, it's got tigers on it. Um, <laughs> and I purchased this before I even heard about or like watched the Tiger King, but anyways, Tiger King. So whenever I see this, I always think of Joe Exotic and Carol Baskin. So anyway, super cute. I love, love, love this like copper camel color. I think it's so cute. The last shirt that I got for Riker, also very dirty, um, but I had to just pull it out and show you guys, um, is this Red Hot Chili Peppers shirt i love um band graphic tees especially for kids the kids both have um the rolling stones one the same as i do um so that we can match so and i couldn't pass up on this red hot chili peppers one that was in his size i thought it was so adorable i think that like the last two shirts that i showed you are probably my two favorite that i got um the last thing i got from h m is a it's like a jump suit like a jumper um kind of in that camel coppery um brownish tone as well and here i'll kind of close up it is striped it is and it's not even picking up on the camera very well it's um like that brown color and white stripe i will have a link below they have a better picture of it on the website than what my camera is picking up here um but again with the buttons and the little pocket um and then this is it's like a shorter style so he could wear some like flippy floppies and like a little trucker hat with this um and if it's a little bit chilly you can still throw um that sweatshirt on top all of this is meant it's almost like a pocket wardrobe where everything can kind of like intermix um and like would all match together um i'm not like i don't like buying specific outfits um for the kids where like you know you have to wear this outfit together for it to match and you have to wear this outfit together for it to match um i like any things that i can kind of interchange and change the look up a little bit um and then down below i just wanted to mention this quickly too down below i have a link for binky bro hats so if you like those little snapback trucker hats um in baby sizes they have the cutest stuff and they have I plan to get, um, they have like a windbreaker type jacket. It's like, kind of like a Nike st style looking jacket. Um, I, but they have it in like little kid sizing, little bro sizing. Um, so I plan to get them that, but um, also just ordered 
um, a three pack of those little snapback trucker hats. So we'll see if he wears those. He also has a couple of beanies um, that I think are just so cute. But um, but yeah, and, and my style could be completely different than yours, but I just like to dress him up like a little bro. I think it's just the cutest thing on the planet. So anyway, that's what I got from H&M. Um, I'm gonna move into Little Sleepies. I've gotten so many questions in regards to Little, little Sleepies. Um, they're a new brand that I just found actually. Um, on Facebook, I had a lot of my mom friends like recommending that I go and I check this out and I like went to their VIP board. Um, I'll leave that link down below because that's where they announce like all of their releases and they, I, it took me a long time to take the plunge to purchase and then once I purchased one set, so I got one for Riker, I got one for Kaya, um, and once I saw the quality, I went crazy. Um, I went and I purchased two more. They are on the more expensive side, um, but I totally think that they're worth it. They're like $30 a piece. You can usually find a, I wanna say it's like a 15 to 20% off coupon. Um, you can always have access to, there's, um, I have always had access to a 15 to 20% off coupon. Um, and then they sent me another coupon when I per, after I made my first purchase. Um, and they also have like, if you think that, you know, that $30 is maybe a little bit too expensive, they do have like the Sezzle payment where you can pay in four sections. This is not sponsored, I'm just telling you guys because, because I think that these pajamas are literally the best things on the planet. Which coming from me, and I'm a Burt's Bees lover, this is, it's saying a lot. Burt's Bees is still my second favorite. Don't worry, Burt's Bees, still love you. But um, these are so thin and stretchy. Just wait, you guys. Okay, so the first one I'm going to show you is, so the first one I'm going to show you, he wore last night, so um, he wore it for breakfast this morning and it's covered in oatmeal. But I had to show you guys this one. Um, I've gotten a lot of questions on it. This is the, I'm like pulling granola off of it. Um, this is the Dino Sleeper. It, they are so stretchy, like look at that, and they're so thin, um, but they don't fade. That's another thing too, is when you wash them, they don't fade. Um, and then, come on guys. Um, just, and they're so soft. And my husband made a comment about these pajamas when we first got them and thought that they were such good quality. Um, I do, I wash these and then I will like lay them out to dry so that, um, we don't get any like pilling or anything like that. But, um, go onto the, the website and onto the Facebook pages. People rave about these. These are awesome. So anyways, I got this and I like the print. I'm very picky about the print. Like I'm less picky than I am with like, um, like daytime clothes for him, but nonetheless, I'm still picky and I loved the print on this one. Um, something I wanna show you guys is that there is a two way zipper on this. So this is zipped up all the way right now. Um, so you could like zip it down from the top like this. Or um, if you, if you have a littler one who's still getting up in the middle of the night, um, my most favorite, on because I always get zippies for, oh, it's okay, sorry, I've got a really crabby baby. He just woke up from a nap, but if you still have, um, if you order this in a smaller size and your little your little one is still waking up in the middle of the night and those diaper changes, the zippies were my favorite, and you can zip this up from the bottom as well. See, for diaper change. So you can zip from the top and from the bottom. There's two zippers, and then there's that little zipper protector up here as well, which I feel like is much bigger than most of the zipper protectors, you know, so that they don't like flip and like push them in the chin. Um, and then this is one of my most favorite things. Now, I should almost like put these back on Riker so I can show you better, but you can have them just be like this, or, you can turn them into footies. There's a little like pocket on the back that you can turn around and it turns it into footie pajamas. All right, so like I said, awesome pajamas. They'll last you forever. Change them from footies to non-footies um, to like buy you some length time. Super awesome. The dinos are my favorite so far. Um, and then I got Riker after I purchased this first one. I fell in love. So, um, and then I'll show you what Kaya's look like here in a second too. She has a two piece. Kaya has the two piece set. Sorry, the kids are like, brr, like losing it in the background. Um, Kaya has a two piece cause she's just a little bit too big for the, like for the one piece, um, the, for the zippies. <laughs> um, 
So I also got Riker the blue rainbow ones and the little sleepies. Again, same thing. They have, you can kind of see it better on this lighter colored one, but it's got that pocket. You can flip it so that it turns into footy pajamas. And then again, unflip if you just want them um, to have their little feet out. Um, it doesn't have the flippy on um, on the like art for on the hands that I've seen, like on the Burt's Bees ones, they have them on the hands um, so that you can cover their hands when they're smaller but um, it has the two-way zipper, has that zipper protector on the top, and I love the rainbow print. If they came out like with a copper rainbow print, I would probably lose my mind. I think that, I don't know, like the copper rainbows with like the muted like rainbow colors are so freaking cute. Um, there's been like a lot of that on Pinterest lately, but um, the last thing that I got for Riker from Little Sleepies was the Whale Shark um, jammy print. And these are just so sweet. I love whale sharks. Um, Mike and I both love whale sharks. We love whales, we love sharks, we love all things ocean. Um, we love like all things ocean. And I love this like muted, like bluish, almost like a purpley color. It's not purpley, it's like a blue gray is how, how I would describe this. So cute. Um, I am, again, obsessed. They're so stretchy, they're so soft like the lightest, comfiest summer jammies ever. And I don't want him, like we go camping a lot, so he needs to have like his legs covered to protect him from mosquitoes and stuff. Um, but I also uh, but I also don't want him to get like overheated, so I don't want it to be like fleece. Um, so anyways, those are just like the most perfect summer jammies. Kaya, do you wanna come show them what your jammies look like? Guys, <laughs> they're closing their eyes. And open eyes. <gasps> Aren't they so cute? They're like a purple watercolor. She's like messy right now, but um. I got a baby. You got a baby in your belly? Yep. What'd you get on your shirt? I don't know. But these are, them. yep, so I got her an oversized. I got her like a seven, eight, and she's more so in like a five T, six T right now. And they still fit her really well. She just like pulls them up a little bit. Um, Kaya will not sit still for me to show the rest of the jammies, but those are also little sleepies and I'll have those linked down below for you as well. Um, and the, Kaya's is a two piece and it has cuffs on um, the sleeves and cuffs on the bottom. So like I said, even though they're a little bit bigger, those cuffs kind of keep them in place. Um, and they fit her, um, her waist nicely. What? I like to size up in jammies. So I also sized up in the little sleepies. I got him in 18 to 24 month. So they are in six, they are in six month increments, um, just like the H and M clothing items are. Um, so, but I got him obviously much bigger. I could have gotten him at 12 to 18 month because he's 14 months. But I sized up, and they are a little baggy on him. They are a little big, but but they will last him for a long time, and that's what I'm going for here. Um, no, no, especially no, with these no, nicer no. jammies, I want them to last a while. So they're just like the most amazing material, you guys. And Kaya already has a min bajillion million pairs of jammies that she's um, gotten over the years, and she doesn't grow as fast right now. She's kind of, I mean, she's still growing, but she's not growing as fast as Riker. Um, so she's got a ton of jammies that she needs to grow out of before I go and totally restock on a bunch of little sleepies for her, but I will. I will be restocking for the little sleepies because they're so awesome. But all right, my kids are going crazy. So I'm gonna wrap up the video there for today. I hope you enjoyed this spring clothing haul for the kids. And make your backpack doesn't get in your way. <laughs> okay. Anyways, you guys, I have lots of fun videos coming up for you. I have another cleaning video coming up. I have a day in the life coming up. I also have um, something else that I've been starting while on quarantine um, is I have totally rechanged my diet. Um, I have decided that I'm just gonna lose the rest of my weight. Um, I'm gonna have some fun with losing my weight this summer. Um, I kicked up my um, supplement routine just because I'm dealing with some um, internal inflammation. Um, as you guys probably saw in one of my other videos, um, I'm dealing with costochondritis right now um, in my upper rib cage and so Come with me on my new health journey. It has been, it's exciting planning like a new health journey. So make sure you guys stay tuned for that video as well. I'm super excited to continue to share my weight loss with you guys. Oh. And 
Stay tuned for and a spin clothing haul. And make sure jokes are out of your way. Oh, all the jokes have got to be out of your way. Okay. Uh, make sure you stay tuned for my spring clothing haul coming up here after I'm waiting for something from Urban Outfitters. So after I get that in, it takes like up to nine business days, so it could take a little bit. But once I get that in, I'll record that video. But nonetheless, lots of things are happening right now, especially over on the Eminem Rustics channel. Again, make sure you check out that down below. And make sure you're subscribed to both Eminem Rustics and to us so you can see the behind the scenes of our Eminem Rustics stuff here on the day today. Um, like kid crazy chaos things. So, all right, you guys, thanks so much for tuning in, and I will see you tomorrow for another really fun video. Okay, bye, you guys.